We are very excited to collaborate with the Royal Society to discuss a recent book entitled The Forbidden Garden of Leningrad by uh, Simon Parkin, which is a book that's shortlisted for the Royal Society's Science Book Prize, which celebrates science writing for a general audience. This book tells the story of amazing Russian botanists during World War II who risked their lives to safeguard the world's most diverse collection of uh, plant crops at the Institute of Plant Industry. So one of the plants they had at the Institute in the seed bank were potatoes. Potatoes are not true to seed. So in order to propagate an individual variety of potato that you might be interested in, you have to store the actual tubers. So the potato expert um, at the Institute, Abraham Kamaras, was worried that these potato varieties weren't going to make it into the winter if they were just simply stored um, in a cold room. So uh, they decided to go out into the field and plant potatoes. And Kamaras literally risked his life uh, going out into the field and planting these potatoes, running past our German artillery bombs uh, as he went out into the field to cultivate. And this is just one of many stories of these brave botanists and, and people during this brutal siege of Leningrad. So be sure to check out Simon Parkin's The Forbidden Garden of Leningrad, which is shortlisted for the Royal Society's Science Book Prize.